And if you'll notice in the back, it doesn't look like a traditional refrigerator. There's no compressor, uh, there's no Freon, anything like that. And the whole entire refrigerator itself is very, very light. This will fold down. You can just bend it out of your way. Now what we want to check right now, when you plug the unit in, you want to make sure that, that this fan is spinning. And it is, you can see the fan spinning. And with your meter, you want to check the fan supply, you want to check the, uh, the cooling unit fan supply voltage. This board supplies 12 volts to the, to the Peltier cooling device that's mounted on this heat sink. So you can pick that up at this point. And if you look at the meter, the meter says 12 volts on it. Keep, that's all going to twist in the video. I can't do that. You see the meter says 12 volts on it. Pull back, let us see what I measure. All right, that's good. So. The 12 volts is definitely being supplied to the cooling unit, but the cooling unit is not getting cool. This refrigerator has been left on for 12 hours and it's still 70 degrees inside. Okay, so now that we now we have power going to the unit, we're pretty uh, we're pretty assured that the unit itself is bad. So now we're going to pull that out and replace it. There's two screws on either side. I'd be able to fix this one because I don't know if I had the right module. But I didn't want to waste taking it apart, not to have it filmed, just in case. So I may have to go back and see the other one. Okay. Gently remove the, remove the cooling item. This rear sink removes the heat. This front sink pushes the cold air into the refrigerator. I'm going to start by removing the outer fan and everything, I hope. Mm -hmm. You'll notice there's a little bit of dirt in there. That's gonna, you gotta clean that out before you put it back together or it won't cool as well. The Peltier unit itself is wedged between the two heat sinks. So to get to it, we have to disassemble the heat sinks. In the center here is some silicone sealant on top of the screw to prevent people like you and me from doing what we're doing. <laughs> these after this. Okay, I'm going to separate the units. Oh, looks like the same one. When you separate it, you'll see this uh, white heat sink paste and heat sink. This is the Peltier unit, the thermoelectric device. You'll notice that it has lettering on one side. Uh, the, the lettered side goes to the, is the hot side. And very carefully. the device. Note the number. It's a TEC 15 years ago for some weird reason I actually brought with me to Orlando. Mm -hmm. 
some wires back through. It's porn. Can't screw in another woman. Give a thumbs up. 